In this Canva tutorial, I'm going to show you three quick and easy ways to make professional looking QR codes. So Canva makes it super easy for you to create QR codes and you can add them to pretty much any design you create inside of Canva. Now, if you want to follow along with me in this Canva tutorial, then I've left a link to Canva in the description below this video for quick and easy access to log into your account. Or if you don't yet have an account, then you can use that same link to sign up to Canva for free. Now to create our QR code in Canva, let's first go and select a design. So for this tutorial, I'm going to select a business card. So let's come up to the top and search for a business card. And like I said, you can add a QR code to any type of design, if it's a PDF document or whatever, really. But I'm just going to show you guys how to create a QR code on a business card. And the process is exactly the same. So I'm just going to select this design right here and click on Customize Template. And now we're in the editor of this template. Head over to the left hand sidebar and select Apps. And now comes to the top into the search bar and search for QR. And now Canva is going to show us lots of different apps you can use to create QR codes. Now I've tested out quite a few of these and they're pretty decent. Some of them are quite basic, whereas others give you more customization options. So I'm just going to show you a few different ways now how you can create your QR code in Canva. So the first option, let's choose this one here called QR code. Now this is quite a basic app and it's not going to give you a lot of customization options. But if you just want something quick and simple, then this is a great one to choose. But if you want to create a more of a fancy looking QR code where you add your logo and things like that, then stick with me and I'll show you that next. Anyway, for creating this basic QR code, the first option we've got now is to enter the URL of where we want our QR code to take the person once they scan it. So I'm going to, this example, select my website URL. So I'm going to copy my website URL head back into Canva and paste the URL right in here. And now I've got this option here to customize. Now on this particular app, as I said, this is a basic one. All I can really do for customization is customizing the background color or the foreground color. And the foreground color would be the actual color of the actual pattern that makes up the QR code. So let's perhaps switch this to red and I'll leave the background color for white for now. And here you can also adjust the margin around your QR code as well. Let's just leave that back down to three and I'll click generate code. And now Within a few seconds, this app is going to create the QR code and there it is. And you can move that, drag it around and bring it into your design wherever you want it. And now, since you've already added your URL to the QR code, that is actually already live and ready to go. So once a person scans this, it will automatically take the visitors to the destination URL. So very simple. Now, if you want to create a QR code with a bit more customization option, then come over to the left hand side menu bar and let's go back to apps again. And the app that I quite like for more customization is this one at the top right corner called Gen QR. So if we select this one, now this particular QR code app does actually give us quite a lot of customization options. So for the destination, I'm again going to put my website in there. And now underneath, we've got a few different template styles to choose from. So let's perhaps choose this green one right here. What I particularly like about this Canva app is that as you make any adjustments, you can see it changing instantly in front of you, whereas the previous app didn't show you that. You'd have to create it first to see the changes. So for example, if we adjust the margin, now we can see that margin getting bigger or smaller in our design right here. Now for the background, we can either leave it on a plain fill and change the color. So if I change this to say it's green or bring it down a bit like that, or I can put a gradient on this as well and now choose a couple of different colors, perhaps green and white, or you can choose this other type of gradient style, which will put this background gradient on your QR code like this, which I think looks pretty cool. And then with a the pattern, you can also change the look of the actual pattern of the QR code as well. So you've got different options to select the shapes down here. And if you look closely as we change the shape, we can see that the pattern is actually changing of our QR code here. So I'm gonna leave it on this leaf style for now. And then we've got options for the fill. I'll leave that as it is for now. Now here we can also add our logo to our QR code, which I think is a pretty cool feature. So if I click the button to choose a file, it's going to open the file on my computer. I'm going to choose my logo. And now that has already added the logo right into the center of the QR code, which is pretty cool. And now we've also got the option to select what file type you want. So we've got PNG or JPG, WebP and so on. I'm going to leave it on PNG for now. If I click add design, it's instantly going to pull that into our business card template. And then I can position it where I want. And again, as I've already added the link to this QR code, this QR code is live and ready to go. Once someone scans this, it's going to instantly take them to my website. Now I'll show you one more option, which is if you wanted to make your QR code a bit more arty. So let's go back to the left menu bar and search again for the apps. And this QR code generator app right here called Gen QR Art. If you select this one, this will enable you to create like art style images in your QR code, which is pretty cool, just by using a few prompts that you'd enter down here. So again, we're going to enter our destination URL for the QR code, and we can select the art style. 
and the three they give us here is magic, realistic, or 3D. Let's choose 3D. And then you can select the weight here as well. And now here is where you'd write your prompt, where you tell the AI what kind of design you want in your QR code. So the example prompt that's in there is a colorful galaxy. How about changing that and let's say a dragon sitting on top of a mountain and then click generate. And now the QR code generator is going to create that QR code for us. And hopefully it's going to have the image of a dragon on top of a mountain. So I'm going to pause the video just so I don't waste your time. Okay, and here is our QR code with our design. So pretty cool. I mean, I think it's a pretty cool image. If we click on add design, it's going to now add that to our template. There we go. So then I can move that around. And again, as I've already linked this to my website, this QR code is also ready to go and live. So when someone scans this, they'll instantly be taken to my website. Now, if you've got value from this video, then please do like, share and subscribe. It really helps my channel out a lot and I really appreciate it. Now, if you want more Canva tutorials like this one, then subscribe to my channel for the latest videos.